All right, so the CIA is interviewing three candidates for a new uh, agent position. And uh, they, they've, they've all gone through a bunch of tests, psychological tests, written tests, physical tests, all kinds of different stuff, medical tests. And uh, they're to the very last, the very last test. And uh, they bring them in one by one. The, the first guy comes in and uh, the agents there tell him, say, you know, look, one of, the, one of the biggest things about being an agent is you have to be loyal. And I mean loyal beyond anything. You have to be able, willing to do anything we tell you with that question. And the guy says, yeah, I, I understand. And they said, okay, well, uh, in the next room we've got your wife. And here's a gun. You need to go in and shoot her. And uh, the guy's like, I, well, I, I can't go kill my wife. And... Uh, they just go, oh, well, you know, we understand, but, uh, you know, that just means you're not the right guy for this, this agent position. So they dismiss him. So uh, they bring in the next guy, and they tell him the same thing. They said, your, your wife's in the other room. You, here's a gun. You need to kill her. And uh, so the guy goes in, the, picks up the gun, goes in the room, and closes the door. And after about five minutes, he comes back and crying, and he says, I just can't do it. And they said, okay, we understand, not a problem, and they dismiss him. And so the, the next candidate is a, is a woman, and uh, she comes in, and uh, they tell him the same thing, but they say, you know, uh, we have your husband in the next room, here's this gun, you need to go in there and, and kill him. So she picks up the gun, she opens up the door, walks in, and they hear a bunch of shots, and then silence, and then a big ruckus and screaming, and and a few minutes later, she comes back out and she goes, You guys didn't tell me the gun was filled with blanks. I had to beat him to death with the chair. <laughs>